sat in Don's quiet, a clear thought rang out within me. I choose a gentler life, filled with abundance and creativity. My heart whispered as the magpie robin sang her song. The more fearful part of me whispered back, Oh, but this world is no longer a place for the gentle. Look around you. So where do the gentler folk take refuge? The wilder folk, the forest children, who'd much rather live closer to the earth than breathe in sky? In my heart, I know there are many of you, some hiding in plain sight, some living with joy and abundance in your own forests of making. And some, like me, wishing and hoping. So until I come upon you, kindred spirits, I take refuge in my glorious solitude. I stitch cloth, weave stories, paint sparrows. I tread as lightly as I can and with as much grace as I can muster. I listen and I learn. And on days when my heart stumbles and I lose hope, I remember the words of Clarissa Pinkolaeste. The doors to the world of the wild self are few but precious. If you have a deep scar, that is a door. If you have an old, old story, that is a door. If you love the sky and the water so much you almost cannot bear it, that is a door. If you yearn for a deeper life, a full life, a sane life, that is a door. Stay snug, my gentle folk.